All right, guys. So we are just waiting for Mr. King himself, Mr. Iconic, to arrive. Yes. Yes. Y'all see it. Mm -hmm. The king. You see it. You see it. The king is in the house. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm looking real tanked up on a Tuesday afternoon. Yes. Even though it's Wednesday. It is Wednesday. Well, how y'all doing? It's your guy, Iconic. Maybe I should go by Iconic the Icon. Mm. Yeah. Maybe not. So guys, we are talking about one of y'all's favorite topics, and that is Polly. Uh, we are doing uh, Redefining Love, our mono Polly adventure. So we haven't really talked about Polly in a while. Um, here and there, bits and pieces, we took a hiatus only because we kind of you know, it was a bit much of, on the discovery end. And so just kind of updating you on our adventures thus far, where we're at, how we feel about it. Are we forward? Are we not? What's the deal? So what's the deal, Mr. King? The dilly, 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 yo, I, I, I'm going to be honest, I was amazed by how good you're looking on here right now. Like, I know. Thank you. And it's like, I can feel you. It's like you're really here. Yeah. There you go. Keep doing Uh-huh. Yeah. <sighs> Got that nipple hard. Wow. Hard. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Got no hard. So, yes. The king is really in the house. Uh, literally. He's here. And he's going to be on. here. Alexa, my king is here. Welcome home, King. Your goddess has been waiting for you. Please get comfortable, and she is going to make sure your stay is pleasurable and memorable. If you need anything, let me know, but for now, just lay back, and she'll take care of everything else. Did y'all hear that? Did y'all hear that? She had that done for me last year? Last year? Yeah. I've had Alexa for a while. Or was it this year? No, I think it was last year. I've had her since last year. Yeah. So. So, so yes, he has. That's one of the, the program. I found another one that I programmed in there. Um, Man, I'm, I'm looking real like, like I'm not. Yeah, working out does a body. Does a iconic. Icon, good. So we we went to work out today. Yeah, she she feeling it. Feeling it Ooh. is an understatement. I like how that tattoo is peeking out. Like, come see more. Yes. <coughs> Y'all will get to see our photo shoot. Um, in one of the videos. Um. Yeah, it's this one, I think. But, we're, yes, I programmed Alexa to be very naughty. Um, but we went to work out. He's been working out, slimming up. Like, guys can lose weight just like this. And we try and lose weight. And it'd be like... A ratio of like one percent to their like eighty nine percent. Like they can lose weight just like that. I don't think I like that number. That percentage eighty nine. How about sixty nine percent? Okay, sixty nine. Okay. So, anyways, we have been. He has been working out, getting himself healthy. He's been working out since May. Ish. End of May. Um, I'm just looking to see what the subject is right now. Oh, it's at the top. Oh, love our. I just, I literally just said it. I know. I was too, like I said, I was 
do you see how good you look right now? He just Even though you focus. got a space booby. I know. I'm, I'm kind of like, I got a hole. You got an icebox where space. my heart used to be. Yeah, I'm out of space. Mm. Told y'all, y'all better start making y'all love out of this world. I'm telling you. So we we've kind of put a pause, a slight pause on the um, finding that third. Yes, the third, or even the, opening up the the door to allow a third to come in. Because quite frankly, right now it's just not not the time. Um, and quite frankly, like what we've been through and, and all that stuff, the ups and downs, the ins and outs, lefts and rights, all that stuff, like she got to enjoy, she has to enjoy the version of me now. And I have to enjoy the version of her now because I'm. it's definitely not the same as it was. And you know, to to open up that door, you it won't. There will not be enough time to really enjoy the fruits of her labor and the fruits of my labor. You know what I'm saying? Like, like these past few days, just being we 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 catering to each other back and forth. You know, so. You know, yeah, it's really just so our story kind of fast forward from the vlog rewinds is right now we are on the get to know this version of us. And it's kind of so we've been he's obviously, as you guys know, from our past videos, um, he's been in Minnesota and I've been here in Arizona. And so we travel back and forth to see each other, but um, he's now he's here in Arizona. Um, I, I, I'm trying to get back to Minnesota, but because of my whole health situation, um, I can't fly yet. So, and, and by the time I can, hopefully we'll be flying together. Um, sooner than later um so we've been apart since we've been married which halloween will be one year and so well yeah it'll be the one year being remarried but then since, since four dealing with each other yeah but just being re back together, remarried, new versions of us. Mm -hmm. We've been apart. Even when we got married, we got married. And the next day, we flew back to separate states. And so it's kind of... But we did get to consummate. Don't don't worry about that. We got to consummate that mob. Which I don't think we did the last time. I don't, I don't recall. Um, but... So it's kind of been like that where I traveled to Minnesota, he travels here, we travel to Vegas together or meet each other in Vegas. Um, that's kind of how, been, how it's been. You are distracting me. Um, so that's how it's been. We've been apart more than together. So to bring someone else in is kind of like be fair. it wouldn't be fair to them it right and it and and that was more of his decision um so I, I that was, speaks a, a lot about my character think about it yeah i was all for whatever did he i wanted. not just sound like cj so cool real yeah. quick like, yes yo yes. let me get my props like so but i was all gonna, for if you're gonna deal with more than multiple people in your life you gotta come correct with yourself so you can come come correct with people around you that you love and that you cherish right so i was all for whatever he wanted 
and we've talked about it on camera, so you should watch, you know, I mean, we've been recording on this channel now since January, I believe. Um, yes. So our new channel, we've been recording since January, and we've stayed really consistent. Um, that's crazy. And it was... All it, these videos. It made me think, too. Like, uh, we went to... Um, we went to the movie theaters during the whole Sunday of all the movies, four dollars per person or whatever. And uh she went to the bathroom. I was waiting for her to come out, and I seen a a, a poly couple, you know, two women, one male. They are they had all kissed at the same time, you know. I'm I'm thinking they went to the movies. I'm like, and they they seem happy. They was you know. The, the women talked while the dude was in his phone, you know, so it, it, it made me think like, would that, could that be us, you know, but who knows? Yeah, we don't know. We've kind of, I guess I won't even say, I, I just respect what he wants and he has decided that he's just putting it on hold, kind of focus on us for now. He's still poly. He's still all about being poly, but. And she's mono. She don't got mono, but she's mono. And then together we're Monopoly. So there you go. Yes. Mono, poly, Monopoly. I think it's kind of cool how that really says Monopoly. Mm -hmm. And then when you think about the game itself, Monopoly, what are you trying to do? You're the trying to get life. it. It's the game of life, and you're trying to get it all. Yeah. You're trying to have multiple properties, but then with the poly, it's like almost like with multiple properties, you got to have multiple people that can take care of your baby, so to speak, just as much as you can to basically have your best interests at heart, you know? Yeah. So that would be good. So... You know, if it happens, it happens. We're not looking for it. I honestly, like, I'm kind of disappointed in even, I mean, it took me some time to be comfortable with the whole idea, but he always kept saying, if this is not what you want, let me know. If this is not what you want, let me know. And so I had to take time to kind of understand what I was walking into, what I was getting into um what it meant what it excuse me what it stood for what it looked like i really have the hiccups um what it looked like time wise i mean we had a rough patch of trying to kind of paint the picture of what this was going to look like and for me i came in with the, the i guess you could say a misunderstanding of Polly was him with two females and me by myself because I knew and still stand on the fact that most of these women are bisexual so they want to be with another woman and that's just not what I'm on mm -hmm. and I'm realizing also by being in you know the Facebook groups and stuff like that oops did I say it maybe you'll find me there oh no probably not anyway um <laughs> the fact that some of some of the bisexual women um they're looking for dynamics uh well the two that I ask I'm not but I'm gonna base it off the two that I ask they they are okay with just not because they 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 upload their introduction and there are dynamics they can have MFF or FMF. And when they put FMF, then I'm like, oh, okay, you want me as the hen. So I'm, of course, if you have, if you say you're bi and you say that one of your dynamics is MFM, not M, MFM, MF. Male, female, male is what you oh. said. Well, FMF. 
I'm like, so you you went you you can be in a relationship and not want to have sex with a female? And they was like, yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay. I, you know, even though I saw it, it took me time to even ask a person, a female that said that. But I'm understanding now because um, I'm seeing a lot of women in there in couples where the female is by and it's just they've been doing the monogamous thing. So I was like, it just starting to dawn on me, like, I guess it can happen that they are okay with being in a, you know, not having to deal with the female, you know. Not having a sexual relationship, relationship with, with the, the female. female. Yeah. So it's it's just, it's, it's real interesting. Um, I think I've learned a lot about like the different dynamics and stuff like that. And now I'm just looking at, at how people are moving and grooving and what they're saying and all this stuff, you know? Yeah. So it is what it is. I, I mean, I would hope that, um, what? No, I was looking at your boobies. Go ahead. Well, I would hope that us being adventurous and wanting to travel and, you know, owning land and, you know, having businesses that we would find someone of the, of the equal stature, understanding, same mindset that wants all of that as well. And we just do our thing and have fun and you know, live the life, but I, I, the scroll of requirements that some of these females have put in these groups of what they're looking for, what they'll accept, what they won't accept. Oh, if you're married, then you got to get divorced because it needs to be equal. Like they have a scroll, a laundry list of requirements. And it's just like, how are you as someone new to come in to something that I get is already established, but we're bringing you in on the same level. We're not saying, oh, well, you didn't help earn all this stuff. You didn't, you weren't with us through the struggle. So you get to sleep, you know, in, in have a life that's less than us. We're Basically, not saying that. You, you think you're coming in to be the redheaded stepchild. No offense, baby. Okay. But that's the saying though, redheaded stepchild. I got them <clears throat> to my to my poly community, um, and it, it, it's like the hierarchy or or the high hierarchy. Hier hierarchy. Hierarchy. Hier yeah, hierarchy. I don't. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Um, and then for the the, the people that's trying to come in or whatever want to come in and they say well, we want to be equal and this and that. I, I understand want to be treated equal. But if you're coming in and I'm trying to get to know you, it takes time for you to get to, I would say, the level of love that me, that I have with her. You know what I'm saying? So to come in with that mindset, is that right? To want to be already shoot up to the top like it's almost like coming into a job you you got to do the grunt work before you become a manager like what makes you think that you're gonna come in and jump right to you should have the same type of type of love for me and that that you have with your wife first of all i have love for you i have love for you but can we can we let that grow and nurture to the point where, yo, I can, without a doubt, say, you know what? I will die for you. For me, I hold that near and dear. When we got together, she even knew I'm not going to say I love you unless I know for sure that I want that I love you and that I could take a bullet for you. Most people don't understand 
life. Think about it. You're having somebody say they love you to the point where they'll give up their life for you. Because I guarantee you, a person coming in right off the bat and want to be up there to her level of, of what we have, what, what took years to get, what makes you think you're going to get that just like that? You know, I don't know. Am I in the wrong for, for thinking that way? Well, you know what? I'll say this. I'm not in the wrong for thinking that way because that's just my mindset. That's my thought. But I am open to hear what you have to say about it. Maybe you could change my mind. But I'd rather somebody come in and want to do something naturally than to come in and thinking you're going to just shoot up to the top. Come on now. That's that's unrealistic. That's my thoughts, and I'm sticking to it. Sorry, I'm, I'm letting TikTok know we're recording. I approve that I message. to hear what you have to say. <laughs> But really though, um, baby, you looking? I don't know. Right now, you looking good. Look at your skin, baby. Got you on them vitamin E pills. Did you take your vitamin E today? No. No. Right here. Okay. Well, not not on the show. Y'all don't want to see me swallow. I can't show how I swallow. Yeah, you can show them how you swallow. No. You make a little face though, so I don't know. Like I'm gagging. Guys yeah. like that. I'm gonna be honest. She did that and, and I kinda it kinda it kinda it kinda threw me off because I thought I was hurting her. And if I'm and if she feel like if I feel like I'm hurting her in any type of way, shape or form, I go into, you know, fix it mode, so to speak. Like, look here. So it's something I probably got to get used to. What, gagging? No, I'm, I don't, I don't want to gag, baby. No. You don't want to gag? I don't want to gag. I didn't say you. Oh, okay. Well, I got to get used to the noise or the feelings where, where I'm not feeling like I'm hurting you. But you do. How how so? Because you can't just say that. You can't say that and, and, and have people thinking that I'm hurting you. So but you do. How? You know how. No, I don't. Well, what you mean it don't fit? Oh. Um, oh. Um, Y'all know what I'm saying. And, and, and have people thinking that I'm hurting you. So, so you do? How? You know how. No, I don't. Well, what you mean it don't fit? Oh. Um, Y'all know what I'm saying. And, and, and. Trying to put a Mack truck down a straw. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know that that TikTok that's going around. What what old boy? Y'all y'all probably seen him. Uh, what's his name? Um, dang. What's his name? But anyway, he be like long, thick, wide. Yeah, Jazz doesn't like that one. She said it's too inappropriate. What is what he says? Too inappropriate for who? For her. Well, yeah, that's her. Like, that's one thing too. A lot of people say polygamy and all that stuff is inappropriate, and it's like, how, sir? How, ma'am? The Bible that you listen to and read and study by, almost every man in that in in the book. They had more than one female. And then they say, oh, well, it says in Deuteronomy 17. Okay, we look, we're going to talk about that in another YouTube video. Y'all are going, we're going to talk about polygamy in the Bible in like four weeks. Y'all are going to get that video. So we're going to save all that juice all that right. you got pent up. For that, for that. Oh yeah, rub on the chest. He just Go. like when I touch the, him. The nipple, the nipple. Ooh. Stop it! Stop it, sir. Whoa. 
Um, so yes, so we we're not like completely taking it off the table, but he keeps saying it will be easier for me to get someone than it is for him on either level. If I was to get a female or a male, he says it would be easier, but I'm just like, first of all, females need to see him in person. So I don't think the whole online dating thing is going to work because we both tried that and that was a major fail. Um, so meeting a female online is not going to happen because you can't really get to know someone. You can't know their personality. You can't know their, their spirit. You don't know their lifestyle. Like you don't know none of that. I think meeting someone either here in the state we live in, in this, the, the neighboring state, or, um, I'm like, what the heck is pink behind me? But it's the dang light. Um, or if you know, there's the poly cruises and and the trips like that. Poly cruises get the, the bruises. So I think that might be, um, kind of the route that we may go. But I personally don't think even a long distance relationship is suitable because it's really again trying to get someone to know someone long distance and granted we are technically long distance right now but but we already know each other and we just we're just rekindling yeah new so self. trying to get to know someone over the phone facetime compared you know, to 20 plus years come on now it, it's just we make it work we, we are legit an exception because people have a hard time making long distance relationships work in the same state Hell, where they're an hour away. Hold on, hold on. People have a hard time making it work with what? Long distance? With long distance relationship. At the same time, there are the same way you people are are having a hard time making a long distance relationship work is the same type of people they can't even make a make a relationship work across the doggone street. So if it, if you can't make a relationship work long distance, short distance, in the middle distance, then I'm gonna say it. It might be you. It might just be you. You the problem if you can't make a relationship work. Long distance should not have a problem. But I want to feel in touch. I get that. You don't think I want to feel and touch my wife every night? Come on now. But where there's a will, there's a way. Where there's a will, there's a way. And only time will tell. Well, not tell, but, you know. Love takes time to heal when you're hurting so much. Could have said that I was so blind. To let it okay. <clears throat> so, as I was saying, oh, my bad. <laughs> I would prefer it to be someone in state that we can hang out with on occasion, really get to know. That way, it wouldn't be okay who's moving where because we're pretty established where we're at. This is where our businesses are registered. Um, Cause on everything, I'm gonna be honest. I don't care if you fine as hell. I'm not gonna really want to mess with you like that on a sexual level. Like, look here, we we friend in it until I feel whatever. And that's if you're thinking about sex. And that's if you're thinking about sex. Like, I'm no, no. You know, I always think about sex. Let's talk about sex, baby. I got too many songs going on my head. You definitely All do. All right, we're going to go so ahead and end this. We're going to end it, but I just want to finish what I was saying before I was interrupted Interrupted by his singing. Um, I think it should be in-state. It's just more easier for everyone to really get to know and grow and learn and have time even for me, even though I'm not going to be in a relationship with this person, we're sharing all of this. And we have to share space. 
Yeah, that's why I didn't show your. That's why I didn't show. Stop. Okay. It. Um. So we have to, you know. So yes, this is gonna be like someone that I'm be like, hey, he's getting on my nerves. I'm coming over. You know, just like any relationship. Which I never said that, but it, it'll be fun to say it just because I know I can. Whether it's a monogamous or polyamorous, it's like you gotta you gotta work the kinks out, stuff like that. Like the only way you can get over like a issue if you have an issue. So, you know, just like any new relationship you might have come in contact with some type of jealousy. So in order to get over that type of jealousy, you have to work towards it I'm sorry, or, work, yeah. or work through it, so to speak, you know? Try and get our TikToks up. That's, that's multitasking, fine. multitasking. Um, trying to catch the juice while it's flowing. Whoa. All right. Um, but yes, I think in state is where I want it to be, but I think that you know it's gonna be rough. It's gonna be tough. Um, a lot of people have too many demands, and it's like you are treating this whole thing like it's a business. I don't like that. Like that's the the my my, in some ways might have to do it, but it it it, it has to work. As as a business, say for instance, you're a business, I'm a business, and the third person is a business. Mm-hmm. It has to it has to find a way to for it to all to work, you know. Friendship wise, all that stuff, just like yeah. So in a way, it's it, it, it's a business. Because time you spend, you spend too much time at one business. You're not gonna know what's going on with the other business. Well, I get, I get that part, but just the fact of someone coming in with all these demands that are like, we don't even live our life like that. Like, you know, true. And if you get to know us, you'll see you wouldn't even need all those rules and the the laundry list of you know, whatever, because you're going to, I'm content. Like we've talked about what our dynamic would look like, because again, I thought that it was going to be the whole him with two females and me by myself. And so then I was going to have a whole solo thing going on the side. And we talked about all that. And I'm just like, that's. And then like, cause I, okay. So I even, brought it to her like this, like it, it would be other than romance, romance, other than romance, it's, it would be nothing different than how possibly how it is here. You know what I'm saying? Maybe. Maybe. I'm just watching your lips. Oh, okay. Well, it would be no different than here. Like two, two grown women one grown dude. Oh, yes. Know. Okay, so I see what you're saying. At here is in year air. Yeah, here. So, yeah, I understand that. And the thing is, is that's, that's another dynamic or, or understanding that we're all about family. Like, we literally are looking to buy a rather large piece of land and put our family on this land and make sure everybody's straight. You know, build build out how we need to build out on the the container homes and the tiny homes. Um, the mobile homes, because I'm really thinking about going the mobile home route because of at least for the beginning, for the simple fact of how quick it could just set up. You know what I'm saying? Well, yeah, mobile home is a house on wheels. Yeah, and then we could work. That way we're not doing what like Shout out to Life Uncontained, where they was living out of a small camper for a whole year trying to build out their home and stuff like that. And, you know, I kind of don't want to be that displaced. Yeah, no. You know what I I'm need, saying? I need everyday living still. So I'm a little bougie like that. I need my running water. Y'all see she got on that fit, right? If y'all, 
there's there's gonna be a little show on one of the videos that y'all are gonna see possibly in the future. Yeah, mm -hmm. in the future. Yeah. So you know, y'all get to see it. She looked good. I don't think they've ever seen like full body of either one of us. Well, I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm six one, and she's like five two, five three, somewhere in there. I was gonna say like four feet, but you know, okay. So five two, five three, and uh, yeah, that's it. What thick. More? I'm a little thick. A little curvy. in all the all, all the right places. Even my stomach is going down. I was like, okay, look at me. I, was, I, will, I will say stand up, but your moose knuckle will be right in the way. Yeah, we ain't doing all that. Bye. But anyway. So catch us in the next one. That was just an update. We're still here. Our minds are where they We're are. Here. I still support him. Here. He's still for Polly. But we just want to have our time to kind of get reestablished, make sure our foundation is solid before we bring someone else in because if we're not solid right here it's gonna mess up what he got going on over there or even mess up what we have here so we we like this and he trying to bring someone else in that's just gonna be all kinds of problems and my foundation is my found the, my foundation means yeah, straight. means a lot because Without a strong foundation, you can't bring other weight in that might crack and separate that foundation. My and, fellas and, know that terminology. If, if 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 the foundation ain't right, and some females intentionally will try and crack it, so that's why we got to make sure we solid so that we together. I can say, look, you don't see her with that hammer over there trying to break the ground. Shoot, as much PTSD uh, that my that my ex and put me through, I'm, I'm I paid too much attention to details. Yeah. So, so yes. Yeah, so we're still locked and loaded. We still Gucci. With a stop it. Um. But yes, we're gonna end this video because it's, we look. We trying to keep them short for y'all so we don't lose y'all focus and attention. Um, but we definitely want to bring y'all key um, tips, advice to have your face gone. Yeah, it was. Look, oh. turd. Yes. What? Look, we're going into the dark side. Um, anyway. So we want to bring y'all key advice to keep y'all solid, how we do it. We've been around forever. Like we started recording in 2011. That's what our vlog rewinds. I keep referring to them because y'all need to watch them. Um, what you doing? Go like and subscribe right now. Right, right now. So, um, but no, we're trying to make sure we're straight. Sorry, I don't have my glasses on. Um, but yeah, we're good. We're sorry. good. Sorry if that burps. If stinks. there's some, you know, fine female that lives in Phoenix or greater Phoenix, because we're not in Phoenix, but we close enough. I'm going to tell you right now, I seen one on, on Snapchat that lives out here. Out here? Out here, out here. Out here. Oh. But she's married and she's weird and crazy. How I, did you find someone? Well, I don't do know. Do I, I, don't think, I don't think she's Polly. I don't think she's Polly, but I've seen. How do you find people on Snapchat? I don't know. I'll, I'll tell you afterwards. Okay, but she, I, I, I can tell she's crazy. And well, uh, we don't want no crazy. That's no. another thing I worry about is the crazy. Someone's knocking at our door, so we're gonna end the video. Um, but y'all see it? Like, subscribe, subscribe, and don't make your love, don't ground your love. Make, make it, it out, out of this world, world, as you can see. Yes, and we out. This be.